to get ready to change this compressor out. You got the contact uh, 24 volts. Unplug. For that circuit. We're gonna do an acid test. Wow. I was gonna do an acid test. Ain't no refrigerant in the circuit. It's completely flat. So I don't know if it blew its charge or what. I was just told I, to, I was just told to come and change the contact and the compressor. So I don't know if they recovered it already or it blew its charge. I see it got a head right here. I'm gonna take this cover off. Maybe see what happened to it. Disconnected. Yeah, you can see right here. It probably lost its charge. Right there at the pecker head of the terminals. Yeah. So I'm sure that's where it lost the charge at right there. Out of prison came out. Right then, so I'm gonna go out and uh, go get my torches, unweld it, unweld this dryer. Nice little well there. So your trick to take the, if you don't have a key for these locking caps, just get a 516 screw and, uh, you can do it with a drill but try to use a hand tool and uh, just kind of put that in and it should come out it's hard to do with one hand but it's easy with a drill you can just drill it in and it'll screw out Oh, da, da, da. Let me see if I can do it one hand. get a key but uh 516 will work the screw right here too big there's not no self tap i put in there so, so i probably kind of messed it up yeah i can't get it off had to get my drill all right so i'm gonna go get the weld and torches see if i can get that compressor out, out here out of there Got that compressor installed. About to do a leak search. Do a quick leak search on it. Should be cooled down by now.
right, all right. So this is the correct filter dryer that's supposed to go with this unit. The one I took out was a good size, but it was a different uh, copper size. So they kind of bent this line up. So I ended up putting a 50, some 15% some of these orange sticks on there to make sure I don't have any leaks right there. So I'm gonna put a new valve stems in here. We finally getting some of that good weather. Got a high of about 85 today. So I can stay up here all day and change compressors. Since we ain't in the, it's, it's October and we've been in the high 90s. But uh, finally getting some of that good fall weather. So my favorite time of the year. Tied my nitrogen in my uh, vacuum pump up. Forgot to pull it up. Micron gauge on the net right there. Discharge.
gonna smooth that on there like that. So it should be good to go. Got 157 PSI. I'm gonna let that hold for about 10 minutes and uh, pull it back in. Weigh in 19 pounds of refrigerant. Trying to contact them out. Yeah. 19.8. It's still circuit one. Yeah. All right, ace back people. All right, system holds 12 pounds. I mean, 19 pounds. I got 12 in there. kind of delay we got on it but we shall see We got a five minute delay on it. Blower hasn't kicked in yet either. 